Welcome. Upon arriving at any of our facilities, you can expect a member of our team to greet you at the door pretty much the same way as I am right here. And underneath this mask, though, you can expect the same smiling face you've always come to expect from all of our team. We're here to help you, to guide you, and to give you the best advice possible during these most difficult times. One of the big questions that we are still asked is how do we support someone who's grieving when we are absent of some of the traditional ways? We have so many resources at your disposal on our website, on our Facebook, of ways that you can support someone and show them that you care. How are you able to connect with them, reaching out via FaceTime, via Zoom, sending them a meal. We have partnered with local restaurants, Capri, Vito's, your favorite restaurant. Call them and reach out to them. Sending a meal to someone you love is an awesome way to show that you care. If you're unsure of how to support someone who's grieving or what's available to you um, during this time, please reach out to a member of our team at our funeral home, on our Facebook, on our website. We're happy to assist and provide um, information on how to support someone who's grieving because right now they need your support more than ever before. Something we'd really like you to know is that we really are wanting to celebrate life. Even though we have restrictions of six people per visitation with families, we are wanting to celebrate that life that's been well lived. It deserves a story told. So we are going to still celebrate a funeral, um, whether it's via Zoom or a live stream. And we are going to also schedule visitations. So whether it's a private family time for a number of different people over an actual scheduled time frame, or if it's guests that you wish to invite um, that are friends, because sometimes friends is just as much as family. On behalf of all of us in funeral service, I'd also like to extend our thanks to the doctors, the nurses, all, all of the healthcare teams, including the hospitals and administrators, and the City of Windsor, the numerous departments that are helping to make our job just a whole lot easier today. Thank you.